Hi everyone, Kevin Wickos here with another edition of the Run Report. Just want to report back to you on the Sunday sales bill. Today the bill was heard before the General Law Committee and was voted out in the affirmative, 15 to 3. 15 people said yay, 3 said no. This bill modernizes the antiquated blue laws of the state of Connecticut, allowing alcohol to be sold in Connecticut on Sundays from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. and on various holidays if they fall on a Sunday. Additionally, it will also allow packaging owners to go from two stores to three stores. And lastly, the major part of it, it allows some of our brew pubs and beer manufacturers, one of my favorites, Thomas Hooker in Bloomfield, my, one of my former high school classmates, for them to open up a, a restaurant adjacent to their facility. So it's an expansion of business in Connecticut, uh, job creation. It was done on a bipartisan manner. I'm happy to report back that uh, this bill is anticipated to bring in an additional $5.3 million in revenue to the state of Connecticut. Additionally, the one last thing we did was we formed a task force which will meet over the summer and report back by next year the different pricing control measures that were contained within the bill because we felt there was not enough time in the legislative session to deal with quantity discount and minimum bottle pricing. We wanted to study that more in depth and have representatives from the manufacturers, suppliers, wholesale distributors, and the package store owners themselves being able to weigh in and study the issue and bring back their recommendations next session. So, as promised, I reported back the bill. The details are, are contained therein, and we will look back uh, next week on another fascinating subject here at the Legislative Office building. Stay tuned.